Good morning, everybody. RV living with the geezer. As you can say, see, we've got uh, heavy traffic this morning on the main street in Fort Davis. I'm gonna try to get work my way through here. Uh, I don't know. This this is a little bit uh, too white knuckle for me. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and turn here on uh, cemetery. Good old cemetery road. Yeah. Might be going into the sun a little bit right here. But uh we're just riding around doing a little just out for a little ride this morning. I don't think I've shown y'all too much over here on the south side of the 118. These are cabins I used to I used to live in that cabin right down there in the middle. Rented them. They've gone up way up in rent. I was paying seven fifty. That was in twenty sixteen, and uh, they're like eleven hundred to twelve hundred now. Unbelievable. Un Oops, I'm not gonna turn here. I'm gonna go straight. I'm gonna show you the south side of town. Everybody's. Everybody wondering what to do at a four-way stop. Yeah, that's a that's a tough one. <laughs> yes, Cemetery Road. And got some it's a little this floods actually right here. Sometimes when it ever rains out here. I used to come down here on that Meals on Wheels route. I had a couple of stops down this road. There's a, a construction company right there, Martini Storage Buildings. An old van that's been sitting there for about nine months. This used to be called Outfitters. He had feed, uh, he had everything in there. And his wife got sick and he moved, they moved back up to New Hampshire or somewhere up there. Quite a change from Fort Davis. The city, the city, the county bought that building and it's like a, oh, an event center type place now. They've got good view from over this part of town, look. There's Sleeping Lion over there. We'll get up a little higher once we cross this little creek right here. Yeah, not a lot to talk about this morning. I, I did that Saul Ross Museum of the Buzzards. Did that museum video yesterday. It didn't get a whole lot of interest. <clears throat> Videos like that just don't get a lot of views on my channel. Uh, they, uh, it's got to be something a little more controversial. <laughs> or, uh, old geezer might have to start going to that clickbait stuff, huh? You got some. This is called, I think this street right here is called uh, Rattle. There's one in here called Rattlesnake. Oh, coat, that's Coach Whip. Yeah, these streets down over here are uh, named after snakes. All right. Here's one thing about it. A piece of property up here would be pretty neat because you would have, look at this view you would have. Look at this. Let me stop right here. You just sort of over, you up higher than the town. Okay, there's Scobie Mountain over there. See the road winding up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do a video here in a day or two and thank, I've been getting some cards in, guys. Uh, even up at my son's, some cards have been coming in. Uh, sympathy cards for Blanca. Losing Blanca, and I sure appreciate it. No, 
hard to hard to even say thank you for something so kind, you know. It's, This is the county dump right here. What you do, they got these big uh, dumpsters there. And you come out and throw yourself, your stuff. Throw yourself. Yeah, throw yourself in a dumpster, geezer. There you go. In fact, I told my son when I kicked the bucket, just throw, go through. Take the cheapest way out. If you can go find a dumpster somewhere, just throw me in there. What the heck? Doesn't matter to me anymore. I don't have to have air conditioned dumpster. Look at this view. Isn't this something? Like I said, I don't have a lot to say this morning. I'm just just driving around. But uh, yeah, we'll let her run a little longer. I'll show you show you this one part of town over here that I used to deliver it to for the Meals on Wheels. Here's the. Uh, Here's the animal shelter right there. Grand Companions. Oh, it's a wonderful shelter. Uh, and they, uh, they've they got another one in, uh, in Midland, a big one. And that's the, they have a thrift store here where I donate stuff to. Yeah, they do a great job. Yeah, it's a no-kill shelter, that, but but they get to the point where they can't accept any more animals, you know, when they get full. Uh, this is the food pantry. It must be food pantry day, because there's a lot of car, yeah, yeah, it's food pantry day. They do a great job, too, here. Those are great organizations, I tell you what. Helping out the pets and helping out the animals. Mm, helping it. See where my brain is. Helping out. Helping out the pets and the animals and helping out the people. Food pantry helps out people, not animals, geezer. I tell you what, guys. My my head ain't straight on my shoulders. The last this this month, August has been pretty screwed up. Enough said about that. Yeah. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, this is part of my it's part of my meals on wheels route down in here. I miss doing that. Yeah. Talking to those people. One lady uh, I heard got had to her son was taking care of her. He died. And so they had to send her up to Monaghan's to a nursing home. Yeah. Boondocking with Dennis. You'd like this neighborhood around here. There's a lot of rusty stuff for you, buddy. <laughs> We are on the north, oh, east corner of Fort Davis. Fort Davis is, isn't a high income town. No. No, mo most of your money here uh, is they live out on big, 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 big ranches. The, there's a there's a handful of big old multi-millionaire ranchers here that uh, have the money around here. People in town here it's it's not a high it's not a high income place. And here we are back on uh, 118 up. I do not know why that guy honked at me. Maybe I knew him. Tell you what I'm gonna do, guys. I'm gonna pull in here to the old porters. And we'll, uh, we'll terminate this video. Like I say, 
Not a lot to talk about this morning. Yep, here's the old porter. Still got the Hunt Brothers pizza sign on the door. All right, we'll be talking at you later. Stay blessed. Stay positive. And uh, thank you all for watching my videos. Uh, isn't that a pretty sky? Look at that. Wow, little wispy clouds up there this morning. All right, everybody, I'm going to go see if that Wi-Fi in the library is any better than it was yesterday. Uh, that, that Sol Ross video yesterday is 17 minutes. It took seven hours to upload it yesterday. So between the park, or, uh, Wi-Fi, and the library, neither one of them is really any good. So there's the, there's the fort over there. Talk to y'all later. Adios. Bye-bye.